Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Far Cry 3. Um, God. Three stooging myself into this fucking trees. I uh, have chosen to continue playing despite my salts. Uh, I went a different way because I don't want to walk through Komodo Dragon Alley. And... Uh, You know what? That's just, that's just, that's all. That's all. I don't need to say anything else. <sighs> oh, boy. Oh, that's good, guys. Wait, in that case, that means that I can just step in here. Get him, guys. Get him. Yeah. You showed those Kasoris, who's boss, and those pirates. Though, for being honest, I got here and I did, like, most of the work. I killed, like, three guys. They would have ganged up on you otherwise. Man. Pirates are working with the cassowaries, huh? That's dangerous as shit. Who's the man? Me? Hello, brother. Yeah, see, the other guy's a cunt. You just, you just got here. He's like, oh, I did it all by myself. But that guy, he was like, oh, what's up, bro? Sorry, was this your car? Oh god. He'll check it out later. Uh oh. This is a. Uh... Oh, that's nice. Switch your gun. Fuck you. That's not fucking fair. Like, the. the... Why am I still getting this fucking call? Why? How am I possibly still getting this call? Like, sometimes the game will just arbitrarily decide that you will take longer to change your weapon. It is bananas. Gotta say, this fury and rage and, like, aggression and stuff makes me want to kill more pirates, so, like... Yeah, that's a thing, I guess. Okay, now I don't know what this is exactly. It looks like an uncharted level. Like an area of Uncharted 1. But allegedly it's important. And that's why I came down here, so. Great. It's worthless. Yada 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 yada. Like, does it even unlock a quick travel location? No. Okay, well, great. <sighs> That's so worthless. We're heading east now. On the path towards progress. Because, man, I'm the only one who does any work on this island. Recall, that is, in fact, me. I 
I could fill time by talking about the philosophy of this game, but I don't feel like I've got it in me. I'm primarily recording parts like this just for the sake of our archive, you know, so people know that I did it. Because, like, hey, if they won't believe a, like, HD video of me playing it on the internet, they'll believe, they won't believe anything. Like, this is pretty immutable proof, I would say, right? What the hell is this place? Just a rando temple? Cool. Relics, as I've mentioned, are going to be a problem. Since, like, I don't know where all of them are, and I know that they're also on the map. But, like, man... Created not creepy doll head. Yeah, so I was hoping to take a shortcut through here. Oh, it's a fucking cassowary. And pirates, they're working together. Pockets full of grenades and a lot of lust of killing pirates. Excuse me, lust for killing pirates. And that pirates are who I want to kill. Pirates being you. Dude, that guy's appropriating Midwest culture by spoken math. Very good. Oh boy. See, this is a cool thing that isn't used enough, the, the fire tech, where like, there's actual fire spread. And like, the only other game in this era that I can think of that had for real fire spread was like Minecraft. So I think it's really cool, especially in a game where like Molotov cocktails and uh, flamethrowers are a game mechanic, they're present. Like, that's rad, I like that. Let's make a whole bunch of these, huh? Hmm. So every time I, I start doing something on my channel, I begin to grow a little worried. Like, when I uploaded that Femboy's Hoot... Jeez, oh Pete. When I uploaded that Femboy Hooters video, I was like, oh no. This is the most popular thing I've ever done out and away. Am I going to become the Femboy Hooters guy? And I haven't, but I have made a bunch of other Femboy Hooters videos. Or just Femboy adjacent videos, I suppose. Uh, and as I currently speak, the most popular thing on my... Ch See, I've only got one earbud in so I can hear everything else. So that means that I can't, like, echolocate my prey. Or predators, in some cases. Hmm, I wonder if it's that. No, no music. No, stop that. Uh, but anyway, yeah, the most popular video on my channel, which has more views than the two lower ones combined, uh, is a clip of Achievement Hunter, which is a shame, because it's like, I didn't even make that. I just snipped it out because I, I liked it. And like, yeah, I could just become a channel that edits Achievement Hunter, but I have so much of my own things to say. Also, on the topic of um, doing stuff like that, uh, this one guy I used to watch uh, used to make compilations of Best Friends, and it ruined watching uh, Super Best Friends play for him. Because the whole time he was watching, you know, any of his own 
any any of the uh, super best friends videos, he would just be like, "How can I turn this into a, into a compilation?" And like that's a shame, you know, to have uh, your two hobbies unite in such a way that it ruins both of them. This guy needs to go first, I'm thinking. Everyone look over there. And then get you away from there. Drop you. Get down. Yep. Loot the corpse. Now... Let's return to the tall grass and become a Pokemon like I always wanted. I forgot I even had those. Those are probably really useful gameplay things that I'm meant to be using a lot more than I am, and yet I'm not. Okay, well, there goes the alarm, so... I have these five guys to deal with. Yeah, that isn't so, so bad. Go check it out. <laughs> Did you hear that? That was the funniest thing ever. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's the crackhead patrol. Yeah, that was the guy shouting fresh meat. That makes sense. Oh, cool. No alarms triggered. I feel like that shouldn't count. There was definitely an alarm triggered. Just they couldn't push the button on account of their uh, their their broken alarm that I broke. Yeah, I literally can't. I can't put points into anything. Oh God! And there's side quests too. Jesus. I, I didn't even remember that there were side quests. This could be a real issue. Well, let's crack the save house and drop my stuff off. And also, milk it for all it's worth. See if there's any goodies in here. Hand that over. Nice. Um, I've been out of body armor for quite a while, so I'm going to have to get that up. I don't know how important buying those maps is. I know you can find some stuff without it, but like I uh I want to I want to have I want to have them, you know. They're a thing that I can buy. Can you help? Yada yada pirate pirate kill him with the knife. And as I mentioned, this is starting to become very problematic because I don't have my shit. Like I don't have the rest of my tatau and I don't know when it unlocks. I could actually check that, though. Oh, man, huh? Okay, I see the issues. We're going to take a long... We're going to take the long way around... And start with that guy at the very back. 
Because he's in a way that allows him to overlook everyone. But that means that no one's looking at him. Maybe I could even get a death from above. That'd be pretty cool. That went, that was, that was dumb. That went bad. I'm, I will be the first to admit that was stupid. And there's a heavy weapon guy as well. That's pretty, that's shitty. Look at that. There's a rock. Over there, a rock. That was so radical. Okay. That guy could be a real problem. So let's let's see if we can just wait. Huh? Wait for him to turn around. Because if he comes all the way in, then I have uh, free reign to stab him. But if he turns around... Because, yeah, these guys... I, I, I don't even think I have heavy enough artillery to chew through their armor. I have armor, though. Oh wow, and I can't even I can't even hit him. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's a big problem. You ever played Metal Gear Solid 3, dude? I'm not waiting for you to die of old age is what I'm getting at all right so uh I guess you probably need a uh a, a, an ability to uh take down the guys with uh with a knife I'm glad I got a DBA that was cool death from above not doing business as all right where are we heading now Hubert Shore power fine by me. I actually have a um, fair amount of uh, maps for Hubert Shore, I believe. So this should be uh, a decent place to head to. Hello, boar. I do need boar skins. I know this to be true for a fact. I don't know if I need them now, but at some point I have needed boar skin. I'm sorry, turtle. Oh god, it was a Galapagos tortoise. They're so endangered. <laughs> They're so endangered. I'm so sorry. Oh, and they're so peaceful, too. God didn't count on me. Oh, no. World turtle populations will never recover because of what I've done. Honestly, that's one of the best things about Far Cry Primal. The fact that animals can be, like, you can befriend animals. And, like, so they'll just be your ride or die no matter what. That's kind of the best part of Primal. Also, the intense amount of world building and all the other cool shit that goes on, but, like, 
Animals are animals are up there. Let's be frank here. Even though we're chasing. It's like I'm playing golf, but I'm shouting boar. Oh yeah, I got distracted. Anyway, I was worried that I would become the Fembo Hooters guy, whether I wanted to or not. Um, and now, like, I'm kind of, I'm kind of staring down the barrel of being a f the Far Cry guy, because I am playing three on the hardest difficulty, and I'm already, I already want to play Primal on the hardest difficulty. Oh boy. <laughs> oh man. Now that is what I call a steal. Was this dude just running alongside the car and keeping pace with it? I mean, almost. Let's go back and loot those corpses, eh? Oh, my ruck's full. Can't see me. I'm invisible. That sucks, bro. Alright, so I guess we have to bypass this and go instead to up that away. Oh hey, you're an ally, cool. As are you, cool. Um, I'll be taking this car then, because that looks like it's yours. I'm not a thief. This time. I wonder if this helps disguise you, because I know that doing the body drag can actually help disguise you, because it looks as though they're just walking away from a distance. I always love whenever there's an in-game reason for why stuff is happening. Like, oh, hey, the stealth is kind of easy in this game. You know, oh, it's because the pirates are all high on meth and have a slurry of drugs and uh, HIV, or sorry, not HIV, STDs, which HIV is an example of, but uh, yeah, it's because the pirates are all on this like disgusting, sloppy blend of drugs and STDs. Or I guess they're actually STIs now, aren't they? Sorry, I'm a little behind the times. Not working in the, uh, not worth, uh, bit, 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 bit. not working in a healthcare field can certainly make you start to slip. Boars, eh? Let's see if I can't actually. Get some of those out. That's nice. That's good. Oh, jeez, really? You, ha you can't do anything. You just can't do anything. Whenever that happens, you just can't do anything. Where the hell am I? Like, they roll up right next to you. And you may as well just lay down and die. Because there's nothing that you can actually do. Christ, at this point I may as well just go back on the fucking main quest. I know how I'm getting there, though. It's 
So nice of Dr. Earnhardt to uh, put this back up here after I steal it like I do every time. Now, I didn't grab body armor, and you may think, well, that was pretty stupid, and you're right, it was. It was really fucking dumb. Let's bank it down. Because I'm very impatient. I want to get the hell over there as fast as I possibly can. Honestly, do you think I could just, like, push the main quest from here until I get to the ink monster? Or maybe until the wingsuit? Spoilers, by the way. Hello? Oh, Christ, here we go. Dr. Earnhardt? Hey, it's Daisy. I borrowed the doctor's phone. How's the search going? I'm getting closer. How are you? Good. The doctor moved me to this cave under his house. It's safer since the pirates come to buy from him all the time. But get this, I found something down here. You have to see it. Okay, I'll meet you there later. Hopefully with our friends. Great, bye. Let's take a look here. Okay, we got pirate chickens. Dead guy. Hmm. Is this everyone? It doesn't seem like there's that many. I'm like, really, I feel really confident in saying that more are going to step out of the shadows. See, there's one. But even he isn't all of them. Making a bone broth tonight for dinner. Out of uh, pork bones. I'm hoping it'll be tasty. AF. That's short for as fuck. How did that not kill him? This is a real pain in my ass. Oh man, really? I know, I know, I do. I really like bilking them from a distance with the uh, the arrows. Oh. Well, hi there. Who is seeing me over here? There's no one over there. There's another one. Oh boy. That's okay. Oh, for Hello? God's sake. Hey, it's Daisy. I borrowed the doctor's phone. How's the search going? I'm getting closer. How are you? Good. The doctor moved me to this cave under his house. It's safer since the pirates come to buy from him all the time. But get this, I found something down here. You have to see it. Okay, I'll meet you there later. Never tell the captain anything, naturally. Great, bye. <sighs> what if I don't want to do the mission, huh? Oh, fuck off.
thought this game was supposed to be open world. Trying to trap me in a little box. Make me play your game. God forbid I play the video game I paid for. This is probably a much better vantage point. So my issue, I think, came from when I shot at that guy and missed. Okay. Alright. I see the bloody path of destruction I should take. Jesus, Jason. That was like five feet. I could have fallen that. I will cut a swath through these pirates. My defenses are impregnable and my style is impetuous. Okay. That guy could be a problem. Nobody's here. No one's here. Chill out. No one's here. And we step. And we walk. And we run. Next, the guy up on the hill. Sun's going down. I wonder how much that changes about sneaking missions. So my brother, who is seven, I brought him up before, um, has played Far Cry 3. And you might say, well, that's a flagrant misuse of parenting. But here's what my dad does. He clears out all the pirates and all the violence. And then my brother goes on a little guided tour of... Uh, a peaceful uh, <laughs> a peaceful Rook Island and says hello to all the animals and stuff. And like, that's all. And uh, he really wants uh, Far Cry Primal because he likes the woolly mammoths. Nope, over there. I need him to not look at me while I stab you in the throat or back. Now get out of my way. Drag, 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 drag. Ring a ding ding. Nope, I'm not here, dude. What are you doing? Oh, for God's sake, I got so close. What happened? He like hit me once. It wasn't even a, a, a machine gun. It was a. I'm gonna have to hear that fucking phone call again. What? God, I just accidentally opened Steam because I tried to hit tab. You guys, you guys. This is where I was last time. Oh wait, is that that guy? I think it is. In that case, that makes my job a little easier. Not 
Now I will stealthily fall my... For fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. God damn it. How about we try a different approach? So all of them are all the way over there. None of them are looking over here now. I could get in there and knife them all. It is possible. Yeah, all of them ran over here. That could prove to be their undoing. Target. This guy's got a fucking throne over here. How about how about some of that, huh? Of course, we've got reinforcements on their way. There goes Black Guy. And another one. Well, there goes that one. Why'd you write my name on it? All right, like I said, impregnable, impetuous. All right. All you found is a knife in the belly, dude. Nice. Tend of popcorn? It's a plate. Oh, for God's sake. I hope that that saved. Though, like I said, that was really well done on my part. It sure would. Yeah, it did. Will you loot the stinking bodies, Jason? Right. Could have gone better. Could have gone worse, though. Because I have made progress. Ample progress, in fact. Excuse me, I've got the hiccups. Oh, it's really serious, too. I probably need to eat um, lunch. That's my thing. Oh man, I'm out of, oh boy, that's not good. 
Oh, good. Another syringe. Okay. All right. First, I've got to loot this body, and if I can find that relic, that'd be great, too. Ooh, yeah, and these containers. Right. That's boogie. Nice relic. She's not here. Who is this? Please. No. I want you to say, Mom, Dad. <laughs> Mom, Dad, I love you. I want to go home. It's very nice. I want you to do it again. No. With more emotion. You can do it, honey. Come on. No. Yo, boss. The pretty boy just raped the car room. The measure is amazing. But that's. I'm directing this film right now, okay? You need to get out of here, man. Those fucking idiot cops are shooting me. Stop swearing. Boss, okay, where you know, are you? Aw, oh, I didn't get to loot that Tigor. All right. Time for more society, man. I honestly think that. Like, one of the just straight-up embarrassing things about um, Superman and Batman Dawn of Justice is that, ah, oh, he's cute, is that um, Lex Luthor in that movie is not conniving, he's not a planner, he's not smart. Ask you a question, who gave you that ink? Huh? Did you that ink? My sister gave you that ink? Huh? You think I makes you one of us? You think that makes you like me? Huh? California boy's got a hard on. Jungle fever. Ugh. I'm gonna drive. Through my sister's skull. Like I did your brother Grant. Fuck you, we're angry, Jason. You are angry. Okay. You get that? I get it. I mean, without family, who the fuck are we? If there was a time where I'd do anything for my sister, and the first time I ever killed was for my sister. It was not enough for her. No, 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 please. You see, the thing about our loved ones, right? Our fucking loved ones! They come and they blindside you every fucking time. So they say to me, they say, boss, boss, who the fuck is it going to be? Them or me? Me or them? <laughs> like, like, you know, like they fucking think that I need to make a fucking choice. <laughs> By the way, this lighter really sucks. You know, so much for poetics. It's really too bad that Citra had to wake you up. Because now the only way to kill you is to erase you completely. So, that's important. It's okay. This is a very important cutscene. It's okay. Jason. I swear to God, man. It's truly beautiful. That you are willing to die for the one you love. So, to continue for what I was saying, it is embarrassing that uh, in Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice, Lex Luthor does not act like Lex Luthor does at all. Like, Lex Luthor is one of the most important characters in comic books, like, ever. Uh, and for him to behave not like himself and more like the Heath Ledger version of Batman's Joker is just straight up embarrassing. And uh, Voss is a very similar kind of villain in that he's another uh, boilerplate clone of the Joker. But he is, he, he's got specifics. He's interesting in very certain ways. Oh, that's nice. I got one. Okay. Oh, boy. 
Uh, sorry, I'm trying to focus on what I'm saying instead of what I'm doing. So, um... Switch to this, that's probably a lot better. So in that, um... Voss mentions that, uh... Part of the reason he's like this is because of his sister, Citra. And, um... One of the things about Citra is that she... No shit, Jason. She's one of the people who gives out tattoos. Tattoos, sorry. Or tattoo. Um, notably, Voss does not have it, despite the fact that he asks if his sister gave them to us. Um, and Voss is not a part of... You know, he's not a warrior, because he doesn't have the ink. But he is a part of the culture to the point where he can say, you have the tattoo, the only way to kill you now is to erase you completely. And part of that is because having the tattoo just mythically, magically, makes you a stronger, better warrior, uh, a stronger fighter. But also, as I mentioned a long time ago, very early in the LP, it is similar to uh, the nature of the Nereverine from Morrowind where the tattoo is a way to mark the player character. It marks the person, Jason, as someone important, and it marks them as someone who is being controlled by someone from another world. You know, I have been, I have been marked as someone significant. I'm, in, I'm now someone important because of this. It's like two feet. You didn't land that? Jesus, guys. Um. Voss is unable to use a modern accoutrement of flame lighting, a lighter, and so gives it to Jason since he thinks it's more Jason style. And also, he is giving Jason a worthless gift. It's a lighter that doesn't light up. And instead, he uses, you know, the more primitive uh, matches, since Voss is meant to be a very base character. He is, he, he's, he's almost like an orc, you know? He is, he is a driving force in the story because of his violence, because of his aggression. Heal, Jason, heal. There you go. I love these uh, kinds of grenade launches, by the way. So Jason's cracking wise here, but this woman's about to die, and also so is everyone else. Yeah, I am. Who's in the wrong here? Like, she's like, oh my god, you're shooting at them. And this is another thing. Um, Lisa here has not been marked. She is not... She has not been marked special, you know? She does not have the tattoo. But Jason does. Jason is a natural at shooting. He has picked up a grenade launcher he's never seen before, and the game gives you a tooltip to let you know what the fuck this thing even is. And you can see here that Jason is also becoming more base and aggressive. He is... Fuck. Probably supposed to shoot that big exploding barrel that explodes. Let me turn this up a little bit. 
All right. Okay, yeah, that's not going to be possible without um, crafting some syringes. Who oh boy. Uh-oh. That isn't good. Oh man, that's not good. There's someone shooting me on the left. This could be trouble. This could be a lot of trouble. They're in front of us! Jason in front! Yeah, I'm like I'm like babysitting this minimap now. Shit, man. This is not good. This, this isn't good. They're in front Jason in front! Shoot the barrel, Jason. Okay. Shit. Okay, so it, <laughs> it can be done. Do I really got to use the worst fucking gun in the game? No, I don't. Wait, maybe I do. Oh man, this is really not good. This is so like I really like have I brought up how I hate the healing system in this game because I do. Like when you need to heal, you can't heal because you use your syringes on dumb shit. There's there's no context for it. It's just it just uses it. You don't get a choice. It just do you have a syringe? Okay, you will now waste it because we've decided that that's what's going to happen. They're in front of us. It's they're really irritating. Front. Like I can't this this isn't going to fucking happen. Can I quit this mission? I can. All right, well, that's going to be the end of this episode. I'll see you guys next time. I've been Alfred. This has been Far Cry 3, um, an ultimately busted game. Anyway, I'll talk more about this later. Uh, but until then, see you guys. I've been Alfred, Far Cry 3, yada, yada, yada. Uh, game needs work. <laughs>